Hi, I'm G. And I'm Michelle. And we are the, the Bin Pickers. Pickers. How you guys doing today? Good, good. No, good, good, good. Uh, let's see. What are we doing today? Haul video. So today... Tired? Today got a little <laughs> messed up. <clears throat> so I'll, I'll... Story time. Let's start right out. Might be TMI, but we'll do it anyways. So... TMI. At like 3.30 in the morning, I woke up with a bad headache. And I get migraines once in a while. I haven't had one for a long time, but like 3.30 in the morning, my head was just pounding so bad, I couldn't even think. And uh, so I took some, what I take? I know what I took. Advil or something. <laughs> I, I, I couldn't even think. My head just hurt so bad. And I had to put a pillow over my head. And, and then I finally got back to sleep. And I didn't wake up until it was almost noon. <laughs> That's how my day started. I never slept that long. Never. In, it was beautiful. Like, ever. And the babies were still sleeping, and the kids were still... It was like, ah, oh, this is so wonderful. I didn't get up and, like, do anything, because I should have, but... So this is the good thing about <laughs> what we do, because I would have missed work, or, I mean... <laughs> Seriously, uh, right? If I had to go to work, so... Right. Yeah, so I didn't get up till like, noon, and then I'm like, okay, I'm gonna print my stuff real quick, <laughs> do a video, and then... Mm -hmm. Um, we sold a Christmas stocking thing that we've had on for a long time. Months. We've had it on for months. And Christmas, as you know, came and went. And then we sold it. <laughs> and I could not find that for anything. I tore everything apart looking for it. I'm like, what happened It was to crazy. It? And like our inventory is like, you know, we have like miscellaneous stuff. Like sheets and um, other pillowcases and like just miscellaneous stuff all in one area and it wasn't in there so we're like where is it so we're looking through the other stuff you know we're looking around like everything and then i'm like I'm, i knew it wasn't in that stuff i'm like i i have no idea where it is and then she said look through the costumes because we had some costumes on that we didn't sell and i just took them in our storage room and dumped them out and i must have put this stocking thing it was in the costume, so that's where it ended up. So an hour later, we found it. <laughs> finally found it. Way behind. So that's the way today's been going. So. Yeah. So we're really, really behind. So I still need to run to the post office. Yeah. Um, but we thought we'd get this video out. We went to the bin once yesterday. Yeah. Um, we like Christmas. You know, it was great yeah. and everything. Yeah. Christmas. We just took took the time off. We went to Michigan. Uh, my cousin had a party. He's got a big building with a bounce house, and there was. 50 kids there that yeah, there was my kids some, got to run around yeah, with. Yeah, it was so fun. Video games, and we had a nice Christmas before Christmas up there. We came home, just had Christmas. We didn't, we didn't a, work at all. We just, like, sat around. It was quiet. We played games and watched movies and yeah, um, <clears throat> just spent some time with the kids and, yeah. Did karaoke. <laughs> it was fun. Yeah. So then we thought we better go to the bin yesterday, so we did. It wasn't super great, but we'll show you what we got. We got a bunch of purses, all that stuff. There were so, so many purses, so many purses. So yeah, there we go. Okay. Well, and then yesterday we're like, we're gonna get there right when they open. We we're totally like rookies, right? Like we used to go to the bed right when they open. They used to open at eight, not well, here. We used to be five minutes from the bed, so I mean it's pretty easy. To well, get even there. in California, when it took us, you know, half an hour, forty-five minutes to get to the bed with traffic. We would still get there when they opened. Yeah. You know, they opened at 8. So we'd get up, we'd go, we'd be there before 8, get in line, get in. So our plan yesterday well, was I to do up, that, too. I woke up, coffee wasn't going, so <laughs> was like, a whole nother... We got there 10 minutes late. We were like, oh, we're like new at this or something. What is the deal? So yeah. we're like, yeah, yeah, we're not going to go when yeah. they open anymore. We're going to start getting back on track now somehow. <laughs> anyway, been... best thing I got, my Goodwill Outlet hat. It was in the bin. So what's yeah. your plan with that? Well, I should be able to go right in the back just start digging now that I think it worked there, right? You should, totally. You should try it. Then I'll get kicked out forever, probably. That's true. Maybe you shouldn't. All right. But obviously somebody would just like threw off their hat or something, or maybe somebody donated it. I don't know. Yeah. Because there it was in the bed. Whatever. Okay, so you want to show them what we got now? We'll or? show them what we got. Okay, here we go. <laughs> we got a bunch of purses. We did. But I think those are last. 
So, Bane suits, we actually put on Bane suits. We sold quite a few Bane suits. Yeah. I was surprised. I didn't put all of them on, but... At first, we were like, oh, we're not selling. And then we sold quite a few, so that was great. And this, um, you know, it's like a full suit. It's yeah. Lane Bryant, right? Yeah, it's Lane Bryant. I don't know if I've ever seen... I mean, it's like a newer tag, right? Yeah, it's... And it's 46DD44DDD. Which I think but, is a great size. Um, I don't know if we've ever cute. had a Lane Bryant swimsuit like that. Maybe. The tag, you know, because Cassique like, is also Lane Bryant. Yeah, so we've we, had some And the of tag those. looks like that. Okay. I don't know. Right. This was just new, a tag, but vintage. Yeah, Somebody had is... one at like, they said 50s, and I don't think it's that old. I think it's probably more 80s. You think so? Maybe. But it's new, a tag. I mean, it's pretty old. From Embreeze. 30, $38 is the What's Embreeze? I don't know what Embreeze is. I don't know. But what's the brand on it? I don't know that either. It's uh, Georgie. Yeah. Made in the USA. I don't know. Purple hat. I don't know. It was new, light. This is my favorite kind of hat to get. That's probably the best thing we got right here. Tilly. Tilly hat. I and love that's these a hats. regular old Tilly hat. Yeah, so it usually has a size. Seven and a quarter. Nice. Love Tilly hats. Yeah. They're so expensive. Like if you go into, you know, like outdoor place had them where we go like gander or something and somewhere so I, i've expensive. seen them yeah they're really expensive i love those hats to sell i never wear them right to sell them because they usually sell she laughed at me when i got this and then she got it anyway so he uh, always wants to get these like robes and things and we've sold them but lately it doesn't seem like we've been selling it but this is this isn't a robe so though what is it it's like a kimono but kimono is usually like a robe but it has kimono oh. sleeves so it's like a nightgown 100% silk, yeah. has Geisha Girls. It doesn't girls. have a brand, it just says 100% silk. So Geisha Girls on it, it it's really cool. I'm going to try it, maybe we should send it out to auction. That's our new thing, we're going to start sending stuff. We're going to try some different stuff coming up this new year. Yeah, we're we going to send talk, out more auctions during the week. Talk about our business plan. You know, so we downgraded our stores a couple months ago to like, not the basic, basic one, but the one up from that. So you get 250 Fixed price, 250 auction. Yeah. And I know people say if you don't want to spend a quarter to list stuff, but we just don't, okay? Yeah. So, <clears throat> so we are going to go with the 250 fixed price, 250 auctions. We're going to send out 250 auction, you know, five days a week, try to get sending some auction Not out. Not 250 auctions every day, but... No, 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 no. Right. Over the month, right? Right. This yeah. is a new Attack Guy Harvey t-shirt. We're going to try that, see how it works. I know a lot of times you sell well, auctions and they're depressing, but we we're going to try it during the week, too, instead of just on the weekends. And Well, okay, so last week or something, we sent out stuff. It was old stuff that we just sent out to auction. Um, you know, and we had a really good day of that. I mean, we didn't sell a ton of it. And we didn't sell it for a lot, either. We didn't, but we still, so we different. sold stuff, and, you know, we size had a large. good sales day. Sorry, size okay. large on that. Um, so I'm like, let's just try to do this. And then we can consistently go, okay, we're going to have, instead of having like $30 days and then you have $500 day, I don't like that. You know, I'd rather have a consistent, yeah. um, days where you can plan on that. Does that make sense? We're going to try it. We're going to try, try some it. different stuff. Um, we don't even know what we're doing. <laughs> well, speak for yourself. I know what I'm doing. Oh, you are? <laughs> you do? I guess. Lula Row, large, extra large. So they're girls, right? They are girls. They're they're girls. They have a little bit of pilling right here, but um, yeah. on the knees. Those knees seem to wear out. I probably kids, you know, they're a little more rough. They can slide around on the carpet and stuff. Yeah, they should have these tough riders and. <laughs> well, they're <coughs> these are horse riding breeches. Um, they have a little. Few we used fuzzies. to get all of the horse riding yeah. breeches that we find, but not anymore. These are girl size 12. Luna fleece. But they're fleece on the inside. So that's yeah. a great thing to put out now. Yeah. Um, and they look like they consistently sold. So what size were they? 12? 12. Girls yeah. 12. Okay. Yeah, and again, they had some pilling. Okay. What's this? Tommy, relax, Tommy Bahama. Extra small. It has a line through it. I thought it was cute because it has pineapples on it. Yeah. How cute is that? Makes me want to go get a doll Whip. <laughs> okay, soon. Very soon. Soon. I hope so. I see this has a little spot on it. I didn't see that when it I got does. it. It does. So I'll have to try uh, to Okay, clean. so here was the thing yesterday. All bunch of store stuff, okay? Yeah. So you know how the stores have the tag, and of course we, we pop the tags off there. I don't want to pay for the tags. I think over 
how many years we've gone to the bed. If you pay for all those tags that were from the stores. Yeah. Um, and it seemed like and every single thing. you have them at, at your house. You know what I mean? You got to. Exactly. You... So we just pop them off at exactly. the bed. But seriously, every single thing we're like, oh, yeah. Oh, big spot. Hole. Stay. Like all this stuff from their stores. I'm like. They Why? put the awfulest stuff in their stores. I don't know. This has a little spot, but yeah, he thought so it was April Cornell when he that's what it, it up. I mean, I just, I just seen the tag. I didn't really look at the tag, but what does but it even like say? But it's like pudding shop or something. Yeah, pudding, pudding shop, shop, which I think is like the same. Oh, size two. That looks big for a size two. And it's all smocked in the front, so is this it is two the back. Or the, just two? It's a two. It's not. It's not. I gotta big. try it's to not, get this spot on it. I guess it has one here yeah, too. But again, this was at their store. Yeah. But pudding shop, they look like they sold so, and it's a cute dress. Pink. Love pink. This had some deodorant on it. Does it? I need to wash it. Right here. Too. Yeah, I forgot. Okay. There's a little deodorant right here, which I could probably take a, you know, those moist wipes from yeah, Dollar Tree. Yeah, wipe it off. Size medium. They change those moist wipes from Dollar Tree. They smell different yeah. than they used to. I think it just depends on where you get them. Do you think? So when I look this sometimes up, I think, sometimes I don't. It um, <clears throat> what? I think it goes like. There's a sleeve over here. Don't ask me how this goes. What did you get here? I don't know. It says wooden ships. This is where your head goes, right? By Paula. So it goes like this. Yeah, it's like. It goes like that. But then I looked it up, and like people have it on as anthropology, but I didn't see that it was anthropology RN number or anything. So small, medium. But it's like mohair, mohair wool, wool, acrylic. I don't know. It's okay. kind of like poncho-y, but it has sleeves. It's kind of funky too, huh? And this was new with tags. That's why I picked it up. But it is cute. Got to figure it out here. I think it goes like this. Oh, this is the back. This is the front. This is the front. So what is this brand? Lillian? I don't know. It's a 2X. Oh, it is? That's what it a says. A 2X jumper? Well, it's like a romper. romper? I mean, that is cute. Come on, look at that with the tie. It's a 2X, are you sure? That's what it says. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I guess so, right? It must be like a Junior's 2X, right? I don't know. It's cute. Okay. No tag bra? And a bra. I was actually, I was talking to this lady at the bin, and she said she only picks up $30 items that she can sell for $30 and more. Right, and she has long tail stuff, so she she doesn't mind just listing it and forgetting it. Just yeah, you know. But she, and that's the way. I mean, we always listed and forgot it, but you know, it's like this bra. You can sell us for thirty dollars, so you don't pick it up. I mean, twenty seven dollars is the price on it. And but so I could I can sell it for like eight bucks. It costs a nickel. Well, nickel and the, in the eight box. That's a cool thing. I mean, she was talking, you know, and we were saying, well, yeah, we sell lower priced items. You know, it's kind of, you know, obviously we don't have an average sale price of 30. Ours is more like 15 to $18. Right. But we sell six, eight dollar stuff too. We do. So like for me, it's hard to just leave. Like if you just saw a $5 bill sitting in the bin, are you going to just leave it there? I mean, I know you have to do some work to you know, get that five bucks yeah. or a $10 bill sitting in there or even, you know, $20 bill. You're just going to leave it sitting in there. But $10, 10 but, times is a hundred bucks. I mean, right. And but, sometimes you don't sell a lot of the 30, 40, $50 stuff or find it at the bin. Sometimes you don't find hardly then any. Then you get nothing. <laughs> yeah. And I would rather but, get 10 things I can sell for $10, 100 bucks. As opposed to getting nothing. But right? that's I what mean, makes that's, it... Everyone, that's our... That's our way. But that's what makes it good, too. Like, everyone can do their own way. And so she's not getting this stuff. So we can get it. Right. You know what I mean? So it actually makes it... It's good because then there's, like... People are getting different stuff at the bin. You know, people have different stuff listed on eBay. So it's actually great because then it... Yeah. It all works out. You know what I mean? I mean, believe me, I like to sell the fifty hundred dollar things. And we do occasionally. But... Man, we wouldn't sell much at all if we didn't sell eight, ten, fifteen dollar stuff, right? For us, it all adds up, so it all works out. Yep, and that's what we do. Everyone does their own thing. This right? says Liz Claiborne Career. Medium. Um, it doesn't have the price on it. I mean, it says fifty dollars. It's J.C. Penny, but wow. it's sparkly. That's it why I thought it was kind of cute. It's sparkly. Medium. Um, and new attack. Okay. Horny toad medium. 
so which is now Toad and Co. But this is a dress, and usually, you know, we can get 15, 20 bucks for the dresses. This has like a pocket down here, you know, so if you're going inside. hiking or something. In a dress? Maybe. I don't know. Do you hike in a dress usually? I don't hike. You don't hike in anything. No. <laughs> We had to go to Walmart. When was it? The 23rd of December. When we went up to Michigan. Yeah. We went up to Walmart on a Sunday and it was like 11 o'clock. And I'm thinking, it's not, I know it's going to be busy, but not. We had to, seriously, we had to hike in because we had to park yeah. so far out. We hiked in. <laughs> you weren't in a dress, good thing, but. I don't know what this is. I don't either. It's a shirt, I think. It has all these beads on it. What is it? It looks like westerny. So B C I H. Best chicken best chicken heels. It says it's from Kohl's. Thirty dollars, right? Yeah. I mean, it's a cute like westerny shirt, right, with beads on it. Okay. This is it missing a belt? Now that I see it, is it? Oh no, it's no, not. It I doesn't thought it have... had all loops. It's like an eyelet like um, so, material. So, ICE, ICE, is that? I guess. $40, this 18W is, This plus is JCPenney, too. Is it? Yeah. Just a cute. It's kind of an orangey red. Yeah. Plus size. Okay. Baden suits. I might, we might go back to some Baden suits because we sold way more than I thought we would, huh? And again, super light for us. Yeah. Um... So even if we're just selling them for eight, ten, twelve, fifteen bucks. Well, we sell most of them over ten dollars. Yeah, I think usually like twelve to fifteen dollars is the average price, yeah. unless it's new or or bigger. Some vintage so stuff or the sold. vintage ones. Like we sold two new ones yesterday for twenty bucks a piece. Yeah, this size fourteen, and that's Ralph Lauren. <clears throat> what bra? Just Victoria's Secret thirty four D D. It's I picked these out. up. I mean, I'm not going to get 30 bucks for it, but paid a nickel, you know, and hopefully I can get 10 bucks, right? You I like turn nickels like, into 10 bucks. You probably, you know, pay 10 cents for it. I don't know. Webster, the Webster Ten Miami cents. Target soft cut bra. You make I me mean, want to wear, uh, wear it. <laughs> wear it? You want to wear it? You make me want to weigh it. <laughs> That's what okay. I'm trying to say. Then I'd have to do math. <laughs> this is super light. This, this only is only three cents. It only it only says sixteen ninety nine from Target. What did you say what it was? Extra the that's Webster, extra large, huh? Webster soft. But it's new. I I can sell this stuff. I mean, this stuff's yeah, easier yeah. to sell than thirty dollars stuff. But that's the thing. It's that's what's great. Everyone do it their own way. And yep. you know you gotta figure out what works for you. Okay. This Victoria's another Victoria's Secret, Secret bra. 34D. Nice. What's this? Uh, so is it a tank top or is it a skirt? Oh, I think it's a skirt. A skirt. Max Studio Size Large from TJ Maxx. $68? Yeah, but TJ Maxx is no. probably like $7. 20. It's a $7 clearance. Yeah. I'll take the <clears throat> TJ Maxx tag off. Yeah. <clears throat> More bathing suits? This is a bathing suit. Oh, this is cute. Look at all the fish on it. Yeah. That is super it's cute. Funky, but it's Diane Van Fossenberg. Oh, right. So it's this it? vintage Diane Van Fossenberg. Size 16. The Color Authority. So that was like, I think, sold through Avon. Through Avon? So, again, when you get bathing suits, like we check, you know, this area. And then also you want to check, like, <laughs> I'm just Gotta saying. Gotta check it. But I'm just saying. And then this back seam sometime pulls. So you just want to, like, check yeah. that. And obviously, if it has, like, a bra built into it, sometimes that disintegrates, so you just want to make sure that that's still intact. And always look for shorts, right? <sighs> Pink, Victoria's this Secret. This is super cute, huh? Colts. It yeah. is cute. It looks nice. This stuff used to be so good. Remember that? Extra small. Could never get it. Now we get it. Yep. This stuff used to be so good, remember? <laughs> You can say that with everything. I Nike guess. tennis, like challenge court. Roger logo. Federer. No, it's not Roger Federer. It's Medium. what's his name? Stampress or whatever his name is. Ooh. I can't even remember what his name is. Mm, so it has tennis. that like tennis court logo yeah. on it. Usually if you can find stuff with that, it, it, I don't, I haven't looked it up in probably 
two years, so I'm not sure. Yeah, we haven't had anything. Look at this. This, this is, is so cute. cute. Vineyard So we had another tea. one of these. And then it was somebody that watches two tea or something. Yeah, she bought it and she sent a picture with her daughter. So cute. Oh my goodness. Oh man, she is adorable. I know she? she was a doll. So that yeah. oh that made me so happy. She's so a 40 cute. vineyard vines. So maybe I'll save this one for Luke. I don't know. You were like, he doesn't need clothes. He doesn't. He has so many. <laughs> <clears throat> so this just looked fancy to me. I mean it doesn't say the brand right here, it just says two T. But it's hand painted. But you know what? I see a little pinhole in the back. Yeah. Now that you hold it up like that, like the lighting is really bad at the bed. Yep. But I'll list it out to auction. Indigo artware, hand painted in Cape Town. Yeah. I mean, look at and look at the twirl skirt. It it's definitely so has two little cute. pinholes. It does. So we'll send that out to auction. Sometimes you miss stuff like that. I'm trying to look through it, but we usually She'll try send to it hold out, the stuff up. We try to sort underneath the lights that they have there. But sometimes, you know. It's dark in there, too. So. He's like, what is this? Is this a skirt? What is this? I don't get so it. It's, it's like twisted. Lululemon, right? It's Lululemon. It has a little logo oh, yeah, right it there. It has a little logo. It's like but, an infinity scarf. But it's twisted. It's supposed to be? It's twisted. It's I don't know what the scarf is. You know, the other one of scarves have the snap. We had one like this before. I so can't remember what it, it like was. This or something? Yeah. Oh, that's kind of cool. See, it could be like a nursing cover, too. Hmm. <laughs> I didn't know they made nursing covers. Yeah, well, I'm sure that's not what they mean to do. But I'm just saying you could use it as that also because it's kind of cool. It has a lot yeah. of material. You could pull it one way or... 36B. So I don't know if this is swim. I'll have to oh, look at the swim style cup? number. It has a built-in bra... Um, you know, with an adjustable... Well, you could definitely wear it as a tank top. No, you can, yeah. So I thought this was cool. And then she said it's a kid's. Because Reebok, CrossFit... This like, has... It's a size medium. It's a girl's. It has to be a girl's. But it has shorts. Yeah, with a built-in liner. We do pretty good with this CrossFit stuff. We sold most of that stuff. I got a whole bunch out one day. We sell most of it. That's the thing. Yeah. It's like... Nike hat. Super light. That's cute. Yeah. I don't know if it's a men's, women's, what? I think it's just one size men's, women's. Unisex. We finally got a Lululemon bra. It's been a while. Some hair on. We had like, remember that one time we got like six of them or something like that? Oh, yeah. And then we hadn't, we didn't find another one since But then. these usually that have all this strappy stuff are usually pretty good. They are. And I, I think this was size six too, which is a good size. It's a size six. I don't know. Size six, yeah. yeah. Purple. I don't know if it's like free to be wild. Why? Well, it's a teeny little like tank that. top, though, isn't it? It is. This did not look like something Athleta would make to me because the green so it's like, a skirt? threw me off. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, like medium. It doesn't really seem Athleta color for some reason. Okay. I don't know why that is. So these were just new. I don't know what Bold Spirit is, but they're extra large, like, workout pants, right? Yeah, they're Bold 24 Spirit. 24 bucks. From it's Sears. from Sears, yeah. So, you know, put that with a top for 15 bucks yeah, or something no, like that. Yeah, no $30, but hopefully I can sell it. Under Armour size large. Women's. It must be. Yeah. Definitely not men's large. Mm-hmm. And <clears throat> pink logo. All right. Youth extra large Under Armour. Nice. I like to get this light. Yeah, and this is super light. We sell this stuff. But that's the thing. I mean, it's like people that don't sell lower price items. You can't get really any exercise, very little exercise that you can sell for thirty dollars or more. Well, I don't. For one, I, I think she does a different. She does a little more vintagey stuff, I think, and yeah. like more, you know, like a different, not like just any clothes. Does that yeah. make sense? We're just like. And she says she does really good doing that. So, yeah. I mean, you know, that's... That's awesome. That's great. And, yeah, leave this stuff for me. Unfortunately, we're addicted, or he's addicted to the bend. So then we, we have... every day. He wants to could. get a ton of stuff, so then we have to do these... Youth large. <laughs> Youth large cold gear. We did get quite a bit of exercise, yep, I guess, again. exercise. Medium. Just Under Armour. The last few times we've gone, there's been tons of exercise stuff there. So this was Adidas, but I thought it was kind of cool. This. What is it? Notre Dame. Climb a light. Notre Dame. Yeah. Nice. 
Nice, nice. These are Adidas, Just too. Adidas, yeah. The women's extra small. They're just little shorty shorts. What does this say? Mm. Active against cancer. Oh, I didn't even read that. Mm. I don't know. Extra small, though. Lululemon. This cup. was in their store. Yeah? Yeah. Did it, said, it have a size? It, I didn't even look. It said three ninety nine in their store. Okay. I don't know. Some of these, I don't see a size right now. I don't yeah. see a size dot. It's probably about a six, but... Just guessing. But, like, why do these ones not have size dot? Like, they just wear off. Must be. Ah. All right, no size on it, but Sorry, I think it's I probably size six. Six, four, six. I so, I know. think these are men's. These are really cool. These huh? feel really cool. Under Armour Extra Large. But they're, like, I don't know. They're, they're really nice shape. I'll look it up. I'll look the style up. Yeah, I'll make sure they're, maybe they're women's, but I think they're men's. But usually, usually the men's, I don't know. Yeah, I'll look it up. Look it up to be sure. More Under Armour. This men's extra large. Orioles, Baltimore Orioles. Yeah, cool. Nice. Very cool. More Under Armour. <laughs> I guess a lot of Under Armour. Yeah, well, we were getting tons, and we weren't. You small it says something. But on see, the like some of this stuff, work I think will be hard out. Great. That's a girls, you said. Yeah, yeah, it's you small. small. It'll be good. Like if we do do auctions five days a week, you know, some of this lighter stuff. So even if we started at five ninety nine, six ninety nine, eight ninety nine, or whatever, yeah, you know, you're still we're still going to be doing pretty good, right? And yeah. hopefully that gets people to your store and you sell more stuff, right? That's what you're. I mean, we for, used to have right? auctions ending every day, and I'm telling you, it used to be about a hundred auctions every day. We would have ending, wasn't it? Like seventy to a hundred every day. Yeah, oh, you never listed a hundred things. But well, I would save them up because I had ink frogs, so I yeah. would save up a bunch of stuff. I guess so. Maybe it was like 50 to 70 yeah. every day on the both of them. So, we, you know, we would be printing that much stuff. We only printed oh, yeah. Monday, Wednesday, and Friday or only went to the post office Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I would print hours and hours of printing. We, we would like turn on the radio. I'd be working and then he would be printing stuff. Yeah. Um, we had a definite groove going then. Now, Yeah, but we had big bills back then. We had to make more money That's back true. then and we worked hard for it. Just these little bags. I, pick I, I always pick these up. I got a whole bunch of them. And then I put, you know, if I make like an underarm, or maybe underarm, Lululemon, like two pants or one pants or whatever, I put a bag in with it sometimes. And sometimes we forget too because we have a bunch of them. I keep yeah. forgetting to do that. This was Under Armour too, right? It's like a but golf I don't even. Score. Well, I guess it does have a logo it down there. It does have the logo embroidered. Size four though. But I mean, this is brand new. Oh yeah, it's like crispy, but it's older. I'm just looking to see what it was from. Okay. Go ahead. 2010. 2010. But it okay. looks really nice. All right. Now we got a few I shoes. I got some shoes. I think these are more Poshmarky. These Toms. You know, they do have a little bit of wear. This one has a little spot right here. We usually sell um, these pretty good. I usually sell them. The bottoms do, but they... We got... These are six and a half and those are seven. Yeah, though. these are seven. But I thought these were kind of a cool pattern on them. So usually with these... I usually sell them for about twenty dollars. Yeah, um, they're a little worn on the bottom though. Might yeah. have to do a little cheaper on those. But well, if I list them out on Poshmark, then or maybe I'll. Okay, now it's all purses. So I got this because it was new a tag, and it's just Charming Charlie, which is just like a, it's like a little store, right? Like a accessories and jewelry store. I'm not really sure. I don't. Thirty five dollars is that? Thirty five dollars. So like with this. It actually looks like an expensive bag with a chain Does quilted it? on it. It looks like a designer I mean, it's bag. Cute. This, I mean, this has so much patina. Look at the patina on it. Distressing. That, huh? Vintage look. I, I did think it was fry, and then when he was like, "Oh, fry," he thought it was too. And I'm like, "Coach, yeah, it's coach." It is really worn. Like it needs yeah. some. I mean, it has like the corners. The corners coming out right there. But some people like the vintage looking. Yeah, if you have things, some you know I mean? boots that are like distressed looking like that, which is pretty in, yeah. that'd go great. It's a it's a cute satchel. Yeah, all leather. Yeah. I don't know if I've really seen a coach like that. This one's dirty, which I could probably wash it because it is fabric. It does have the suede down here though. Coach, it does yeah, have spots. Yeah, it's dirty, but I'll still pick them up. It's dirty on the inside too. It is dirty, isn't it? Mm -hmm. 
So I wonder if I could... I think I could wash that suede because it's like waterproof suede, well, right? I've never seen so many coach purses as I've seen here. There you know lots I mean? of people must have coach here. Must be. <clears throat> okay. This is a big. So what is this? Is this a? It's an overnight bag. Oh, an overnight bag. Or carry-on bag. Or carry-on. We don't get the purses of Kathy Van Zeeland. Okay, I don't get them. This you used has to. just a little bit of wear on the corners. But otherwise, looks pretty nice. And there's a spot right back here, which looks like a wipe right. Yeah, off. that'll wipe. Right but this is actually a nice big bag. It has pockets, you know, to organize yeah, your that. stuff. So if you're going out like a little I mean, this stuff's trip, expensive though, right? I mean, these, the maybe, purses and stuff, right? Wait, I'm like, maybe this is a diaper bag. No, it has like padded for your laptop. Oh. oh so that's kind of cute. Yeah. Um, we used to get all the purses out, but years ago, we, they're, they're just too heavy now, I think, for us to get. Yeah. They don't sell as well as they did. This was cute. It is a little dingy. Yeah, I mean, it has like a... And a spot it on the back. It needs some clean up, but... It's Kate a Kate Spade. Spade. All leather. It's See, all it has like this spot back here. Pebbled leather, color block. The logo's <clears throat> a little worn on the front. But it's actually a pretty cool purse. It's flaps so of this zip, so you can actually store stuff down in there. Yeah. Pretty, pretty nice on the inside. It's not too bad a shape, but it does have wear and stuff might clean up, huh? That is weird, huh? Yeah, so you can put stuff down in there all the way down, I think. Wow. Put all oh, your all the way down. Yeah, put all your important stuff down at the bottom oh, there. All the way down here. Yeah. Has like conceal carry or something in there. That's weird, <laughs> huh? Conceal carry Kate Spade bag? Yeah. Hmm. That happened, right? Vera Bradley. Oh, that's not what I thought it was when I like grabbed it. It certainly doesn't look like a Vera Bradley. No, though. but it is it says Vera Bradley right on the side. Yeah has keys on the inside. That's cute. And it looked pretty nice. <clears throat> I just like to bake getting these things too. I like that's They're part so of our thing. But these don't sell that good. This one's cute though. <laughs> yeah. It has like the every time I see the lettering like this it reminds me of Toy Story for some reason. I don't know why. Hmm. Why is that? Um It doesn't look too bad a shape. Yeah. A this lot is of just times yellow. these things like peel and stuff this kind. Huh. Yeah, it's cute though. Cute bag. How do you not pick up Dooney and Burke purses though? I, I mean, know. you have to, right? So this is just. This is a luggage tag, coach, leopard print, you know, and nobody wrote their name on it or anything yet. Huh. I don't know. Like. So can you sell just this or you probably, put It's probably it on about something? $15 on that. Really? For this? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's why I put it on. I don't know. The last thing. We haven't found a Brahmin purse in a long time. Yeah. It is. It does have some discoloration it, here. It has some wear on it, for sure. But, you know, they're usually brown. But it's that croc, or, right? It's like croco and embossed. But this is... So this is like a newer one. You always see the, the ones that are like leather on the... They all look the same, and this doesn't. So it must be a newer one. I guess it has I mean, some dirty spots inside. spots in it inside, but... You know, I don't know what I'm talking about? They newer, have maybe like within the last 10 years. Yeah, no, they have that leather, like, slots in it. All those. Yeah. Like, we usually would get them. They'd be that black and brown, croco yeah. style. I don't know what that's worth with the wear on it, but pick that up. We still pick it up. Yeah. Maybe we should do a day of, like, auction purses. I think that's a mistake. I got a bunch of purses, but I don't know. I mean, I just had like some of our thread up ones ended again. Yeah. It's like, I don't know if I should relist them by it now or just send them out to auction, try to move them. I'm not sure. We're like reevaluating. Yeah, we're going to we're gonna try some new things and see what happens, right? Well, I just like when see we had works. the auctions end, it just seemed like, you know, obviously, you know, we sold stuff. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like, you know, you make that money. You know what I mean? Yeah. Instead of just waiting for people to come along and hopefully buy stuff from you. But I am going to do, I'm going to take best offer off okay. and run a sale this weekend. Run a sale this weekend. Like, yeah. that's what Anne, she always, like, she's back to, like, she puts her best price, you know, and then she can run a sale, but doesn't do best offer. You know, I mean, you do get a lot of low balls, but I feel like, I get excited when I get an offer at least, because I feel like you're actually moving some stuff, but we're going to try to take it off. And Just for this weekend. Though, yeah, right? I'm going to run a 20% weekend. off sale or something like that. Yeah. So we'll see how that goes. Yeah, we'll try it, right? I just think every time you change something, I think eBay is like, oh, we're going to, you know, like they don't like that. 
I, or I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? People sitting over at eBay going, yeah, block. We're going to block all their stuff. I'm <laughs> just kidding. It, it sure seems like that. My sometimes. conspiracy theories. Okay. Well, why, why do That's they it. want to block your stuff? They don't want you to sell stuff? Because they make money when you make money. Here's what I don't get either. They're like, so people were putting out, you know, they were had all this stuff had ended. Like their auction, or they ended their stuff. eBay had ended people's listings, right? Like just took them off, right? Lindy Glenn did a video about it. She put a post on Instagram about it. Okay, just like stuff it. was just gone. Okay, just gone. When then somebody had posted, eBay actually says, you know, because there's so much stuff that we have... You know, we have the right to just take your stuff off. Does that make sense? Because then it's not fair to other sellers that have the same items at a better price or whatever it said. Whatever it said. But then I, I, don't, I don't get this. Either. But then they want you to do promoted listings, which basically makes your item show up twice. So then people are scrolling through. Twice as many things. Twice as many things. Yet, they don't want as much stuff on there. They're just going to end your stuff. They want more money is what it is. But they're going to put promoted listings and they're going to push, push, push that. So then your item shows up twice. I, I don't understand it. I just really don't get it. What is that? E eBay, I, I feel like they don't know what they're doing at all. <laughs> they don't. They really don't. <laughs> I want the old eBay. <laughs> they, they don't have a clue. I mean, We need Meg back. Bring Meg back. Yeah, <laughs> not kidding. It was definitely a lot better. It was different. Ever I know since times she left, change. It went downhill. Things change. You got to go with the flow. I just thought it was kind of funny that they're like, "Oh, we don't want to, you know, crowd the marketplace with all this stuff." But, but we're gonna put everything on twice. That yeah. So if you pay us more fees, we'll actually put your stuff out there twice. So there's more stuff out there. Interesting. Okay. It's about money for them. I so. know. Well, everything's about money. That's what but I was saying. But taking your stuff off and not showing it. That costs them money. You know what I mean? Like, I don't understand. Why don't they just want... They should be like free. Everyone can list whatever they want. Just like these other sites. Macari, Poshmark. If you want to list your stuff, great. And then somebody buys it, it's more money. Like, I don't understand their mentality of this is what you can list and you can pay this price or... You know what I mean? It doesn't make sense. Know. But hey, whatever. Whatever. We're it is what keep, it is. We're going to keep trying chugging anyways. along and try to make it work for another year. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, right? we'll try another year and see what happens. And yeah, we're re determined. We evaluate after that yes. again, I guess. Or exactly. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Hope you guys it. had a great Christmas. I hope you have a happy New Year. Stay safe. I'm not sure if we're doing another. Oh, we'll do sold Sunday, so we'll see you before that. Yeah, we'll have sold Sunday. Okay. Hopefully, we sell some stuff. Yeah, well, we'll see. So, thank you guys so much for watching and for all your nice comments and everything. We do hope that you had a nice Christmas and. Yeah. Sometimes you just need to take some time off and it's true and sleep until eleven thirty or twelve. <laughs> well, I wish I didn't do that because oh come put on, put me way behind. One today, day, but. seriously, he's never slept in that late. I don't think, and it's like one day. I've known him for almost twenty years. You know, we've been married almost going to be nineteen years. And I feel more tired now than if I would have got know, up that's at what happens. seven o'clock. Okay, we'll stop talking. All right, thank you so much for watching. Hope your Christmas was great. Uh, now we got to get ready for New Year and then sales, sales lots of floor. sales. Yeah. Yep. So, and if you're interested in anything here, obviously that's not why we do this, but if you are, because <laughs> we do have some people email us, you can send me yeah. an email. My email is down below the video. Um, and we do appreciate everybody <laughs> that emails yeah. and um, watches the videos, comments. Thank you so much. Then we wouldn't even have to list it. <laughs> we got to right. list it. We well, got to have stuff. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you, guys. Pick outside the box. God Thanks bless. Bye.